Hi, I'm Christine Patton, and I'm going to give you a quick overview on how to use Yammer, the social networking site that we're going to be using to engage as a learning community. And this is also the space that we're going to be using for our Yam Jam scheduled for next week. So how do we get started? So for those of you who have not created an account yet, you're going to do so by accessing an email invitation that you should have received from me. So the email invitation looks like this. It says, Christine Patton has invited you to the NCPFCE learning community. Once in the email, you'll need to click Accept Invitation. Here on this page, you type in your information. This includes your first name, your last name, and a password that you want to use to log in each time. You also have the option of inserting your job title. Next, you have the option of uploading a picture. So here, the picture is typically a headshot of you as the user so that we can all see who we're talking to and engaging with on the Yammer space. For now, I'm going to skip this. You also have the option of downloading the desktop application, but I'm also going to skip this because I primarily like to use the online space. The online space is the only space that you'll need for the Yam Jam. You do not need the desktop application to participate. So now we have reached the NCPFCE Learning Community Network on Yammer. So the next time you come to Yammer, you're going to use your email address, the one that you received an invitation at, and the password that you just created to log in. So now let's take a look around. This is our main page, this is the home page, and this is where most of the interactions and communications will take place. And if you're familiar with Facebook, this is, the setup is quite similar where you see messages and profile pictures and the navigation is very similar to Facebook as well. And if you happen to navigate away from the homepage at any time, you can return back by simply clicking on our NCPFCE logo here in the corner. If you have something new you want to say or share, you can do that in this box under Share and Update. And clicking Update will move your message down into the main feed here, where everyone can see it. You can also use this box to share a file. So you can upload a file from your computer. Okay. Or post a link. So here I've just posted a link to the Parent, Family, and Community Engagement site on eClick. And I click update and that posts it down into the main feed for everyone to see. Some other things you can do on Yammer is you can use this app section over here to post a file if you forget to do it up in the share and update. And the files I currently have here are our logos and a picture of our design thinkers that work at the learning community meeting. So let's take a look at what that looks like. So this is just a photo montage of pictures that were captured at our in-person meeting back in March. So you can use this space to upload your own files, share them with others, and see what other people have posted. So to go back to the main page, our home page, you can click on my feed here, or you can click on the NCPFCE logo. So if someone posts something in the main feed that's of interest to you, so say if you're interested in hearing more about the eClick site, you can click reply and type a reply directly to this message. And you can also click on people to notify. So if you want someone on your team to see this message and to access this site, you can type in names. And so clicking on Maria, my colleague, Maria should see, receive an email notifying her that she was tagged in this post. Click reply 
and you'll see that Maria is CC'd and that everyone will see that I really like this site. So that was a quick overview of Yammer. Before Tuesday's Yam Jam, we encourage you to come to the site, take a look around, reply to or like some existing posts, or just say hello. So on Tuesday, April 24th, from 4 p.m. to 4.30 p.m. Eastern Time, we're going to be hosting a Yam Jam. So a Yam Jam is an event that takes place on Yammer, our social networking site, during which members come to Yammer at the same time to discuss a specific topic. So Tuesday's topic will be updating us on your prototypes. So we'll ask that you come and share with us a reminder of what your prototype is and also give us any updates on where you are with it. During this time, some staff from NCPFCE will be online and chatting with you, but we want you to use this time to update us and then also share and respond to your colleagues' updates on their prototype. So the conversation will all take place on the main feed of our Yammer page, and we're going to be managing the conversation by tagging with the tag YamJam. So when you come to the site, the first post you'll see will be from me and will be tagged with Yam Jam. It will be a welcome to the event and also will include some basic instructions on how we're going to proceed with the event. And you can participate by replying to posts from myself, other NCPFC staff, and your colleagues. And you can also participate by creating your own status updates with the tag Yam Jam. If you have any technical problems or questions that come up during the Yam Jam, you can post them on Yammer if you're able to get on the site. And if not, you can send an email to me at christine underscore patton at harvard.edu and I'll have my email pulled up during the event to respond to any technical questions that come up. Thank you and I look forward to seeing everyone on the site and hopefully at our Yam Jam event on Tuesday. Thanks.